you will have three types of text. The first one being argument passages which will take a strong position and use evidence to support a claim. Second one being narrative non-fiction passages which will tell you a story with a clear beginning, middle and end. And the last one being informative or explanatory passages which will aim to educate the reader about a topic. What will the questions look like? Now questions are typically of two broad types. The first one being expression of ideas questions which will ask you to improve the effectiveness of communication in a piece of writing. What does that mean? Simply put, you have to choose a better worded option to help the author express his viewpoint effectively. Let us look at an example. Is 0.9 liter or 900 ml and the density you know density of water is 1 gram per liter or gram per ml so from here you can easily solve the mass of water Which is the volume of water times the density of water, which is giving you 900 grams. This is the mass of water. Now, if you want to calculate the NH2O, that is the number of moles of water, you can easily do that because you have already know the mass of water, which is 900 grams. So, number of or NH2 I want to calculate from here which is giving you the 900 gram which is the weight of the water or solvent divided by the molar mass which you already know of 18 for water and this is giving you 50 moles if you calculate you will get 50 moles right vector O into Li plus mg plus mk now what is the vector oa what is vector away you are given what of more of we want more of vector away you are given that given more of vector away is equal to 10 so put here this is equal to and you know that a is equal to half m is equal to 1 by root 2 and a is equal to plus minus half so put here and put the value of mod away that is a 10 so this vector a is equal to 5i plus 5 root 2j plus 5k thank you